The Starbound Quest of Mira and Astra, a journey of courage, friendship, and wonder. In a distant northern village nestled among towering ice peaks and glittering snowfields, lived a young girl named Mira. She was known for her curious nature, always asking questions about the stars, the winds, and the shimmering auroras that danced across the sky every winter. Mira had an extraordinary companion, a snow fox named Astra, who was as playful as he was loyal. Together, they shared a dream of exploring the mystical northern lights and uncovering the secrets of the starbound peaks, a hidden realm that was whispered about in village tales. One crisp winter night, Myra's grandmother told her a story about the starbound peaks, a place where stars were said to meet the earth and grant wisdom to those who dared to visit. Myra's heart raced with excitement, but there was also a warning in the story. Only the brave and pure of heart may enter the starbound peaks, for it is a place that tests the courage and kindness within. That night, as Mira gazed up at the sky with Astra by her side, she saw something incredible. A single, brilliant star fell from the heavens and landed somewhere near the peaks. It glowed bright blue, unlike any star she had seen. She felt an urge, a calling that she could not ignore. Gathering a small pack with her warmest clothes, a lantern, and some bread, Mira set out with Astra to find the fallen star and uncover the secrets of the starbound peaks. The journey was not easy. As they ventured deeper into the icy wilderness, fierce winds howled and towering cliffs loomed above. But Myra's heart remained steady and Astra's playful energy kept her spirits high. Along the way, they encountered creatures Mira had only heard of in stories, whispering owls, who offered riddles and guidance, and shimmering ice sprites that giggled and danced, leaving trails of frost in the air. At one point, a blizzard swept over them, and Myra's courage wavered. The cold was unlike anything she had ever felt, biting through her thick cloak. She and Astra huddled together, their warmth shared, as she whispered words of comfort to her fox friend. Astra, sensing her doubt, looked up at her with eyes that seemed to say, We can do this, Mira. We are strong together. After the storm passed, Mira and Astra reached a frozen lake, its surface like a mirror reflecting the night sky. They could see the bright blue glow of the fallen star across the lake, but it was guarded by a great creature, a silver wolf with eyes like ice and fur that glistened like snow. The wolf's gaze was kind but wary. To reach the starbound peaks, he said in a deep, wise voice, you must prove your heart is pure and your courage unwavering. Mira took a deep breath. I am not here for myself. I am here to learn, to understand, and to share what I find with those who seek wisdom and kindness. The wolf studied her for a long moment, then slowly nodded. You may pass, Mira of the North, for your intentions are noble. As they continued their journey, Mira noticed that the path was now lit with a soft blue glow, guiding them toward the mountain summit. Astra leapt and twirled, his joy evident as they climbed higher. When they finally reached the top, Mira saw the fallen star resting in a small, crystal-clear pool of water. The air around it was warm, despite the icy surroundings, and it pulsed with a gentle, calming light. With Astra by her side, Mira knelt by the pool. She reached out, and as her fingers touched the star, a warmth filled her entire being. She saw visions of her village, her family, the creatures she had met along the way, all interconnected in a beautiful tapestry of life. She felt a deep understanding, a wisdom that filled her with peace and strength. The star's voice echoed in her mind, soft and kind. Mira, you have proven yourself worthy. Share the wisdom you have found. Remember, true courage is not the absence of fear, but the strength to move forward with kindness and love. With a gentle glow, the star lifted from the pool, rising back toward the sky, leaving Mira and Astra filled with awe. She watched as it returned to the heavens, a beacon of hope and wisdom for all who gazed upon it. The journey back home was long, but Mira and Astra felt lighter, their hearts filled with wonder and joy. When they returned to the village, Mira shared her adventure with her grandmother, friends, and all who would listen. The story of Myra's journey became a legend, 
inspiring others to seek courage, kindness, and wisdom within themselves. And every winter night, as the northern lights danced across the sky, Mira would look up, smiling, knowing that somewhere among the stars was the one she had touched, a reminder of her magical journey to the starbound peaks, facts about the north and friendship for kids, northern lights magic. The northern lights are beautiful colors in the sky caused by the sun's particles reacting with Earth's atmosphere, snow foxes' adaptability. Snow foxes like Astra are clever animals that can survive in the freezing cold with their thick fur and amazing hunting skills, bravery and adventure. Just like Mira, being brave doesn't mean you're never scared. It means you keep going even if you feel afraid. Wisdom of Stars Stars have been used for navigation for centuries. In our story, they also bring wisdom and magic. Role of Guardians Guardians, like the Silver Wolf, are protectors who guide those with pure hearts on their journeys. Fallen Stars Myth In many legends, fallen stars are said to grant wisdom or fulfill wishes for those who find them. Vocabulary Overview for Kids Aurora the beautiful lights in the night sky, often seen in the north, also called the northern lights. Blizzard, a very strong snowstorm with high winds, making it hard to see or move. Companion, a friend or someone who goes with you on a journey, like Astra for Mira. Summit, the highest point of a mountain. In our story, it's where Mira finds the star. Guardian, a protector who watches over others, like the silver wolf in the story. Wisdom, Deep understanding and knowledge, often gained from experiences. Glimmer, a small, soft light, like the glow of the star Mira finds. Frostbite, a skin condition caused by extreme cold. In cold places, people are careful to avoid it. Courage, bravery to do something challenging, even if it's a little scary. Echo, a repeated sound that bounces back, like voices in a cave.